back in October of 2013. Uh, I was a relatively uh, new mom, and I had been asked by the Presbyterian woman of the Lake Huron Presbytery. This is in Michigan. Uh, this is my home presbytery, of which I'm still a member. They asked me, Kathy, would you be willing to preach uh, our closing worship service for a day that was centered around human traffic, trafficking awareness and tr human trafficking advocacy? After I preached that sermon, I did come to realize that while that sermon was supposed to be uh, delivered to a group of Presbyterian women, I was preaching that sermon to myself. So the beginnings of um, understanding what do I do is first of all is to understand the church with whom I'm working. If I don't understand that then I'm afraid that uh, the work of addressing human trafficking is simply an appendage or simply just an extension but to, to be rooted in that understanding of church. Organizations with whom they have worked or with whom they already have long-standing relationship in addressing the concerns around migrants, migration, and human trafficking. When I'm working with these organizations, Migrante, Migrante International, Churches Witnessing with Migrants, um, I, am, I am still learning. What do I bring to the table? Um, English is widely spoken and understood, however, uh, when it comes to the heart of meeting people and even worship services for that matter and meetings where things get very passionate people don't speak in English anymore right. <laughs> they're speaking from their hearts so they're speaking from their uh, mother tongue so there is a language barrier and uh, while we've committed to learning and we did set aside some time early on when we first moved um, I think the, the learning is going to have to happen on the job as we go to. <laughs> yep. uh, our family uh, are the second recipients uh, to receive uh, mission monies through the Grace Presbytery. It is our goal as a family to be able to meet as many of the individuals and churches who are supporting us. I have been not only greatly affirmed but greatly encouraged um, by the ways that I hear God is um, at work um, in the life of this presbytery. You can't say thank you enough, but maraming um, salamat, kumapsunida, muchas gracias, merci beaucoup. Uh, however way you understood thank you, understand that from our hearts, from Team Chang Lopez, from our family Juan, our daughter Orly, and myself, we are so grateful uh, for the ways that God has connected us in God's mission. Thank you very much, Grace Presbyterian.